in this course, I'm going to be using VS Code running on a Mac. And I'm going to be running all of my terminal commands within the ZSH terminal inside VS Code. And the relevant VS Code extensions I'm going to be using are auto rename tag, duplicate action, insert numbers, the make apps theme, which is the theme that you see here, the material icon theme, which gives us nice icons in our explorer here, split HTML attributes, which allows us to quickly split all of our attributes and props onto a new line, view three support all in one, which gives us view syntax highlighting and all that stuff and view extension box. And if you want to see the full list of VS code extensions I'm using, go to dannys.link slash VS code setup. Help me out with a quick like, comment, share, or subscribe. For most of this course, I'm going to be using Chrome with the Vue.js DevTools extension. This will allow us to debug all of our Vue and Pinia code. And to get this extension, click on the three dots here, go to extensions, visit Chrome Web Store, search for Vue DevTools, and you can see the extension here. Uh, make sure you get this one, which doesn't have the legacy or beta logo on it. And once you have that installed, we should be good to go to get started. Get the full course, including authentication, row level security and policies, database functions and triggers, storage, edge functions, and running Superbase locally from makeappsacademy.com or click the link in the description.